My goal was never to be the world's strongest man. I was always told that I was too small. I was never gonna be strong enough. I was never really gonna achieve any kind of greatness in the sport. It's a lot of fun for me to be able to prove them all wrong. For me growing up, I was involved in a lot of things. I just tried to find a home wherever I could doing as much as possible. My senior year of college, I actually began going to the gym at five o'clock in the morning before school. And there was one morning I walked in, I said, hey, we found a local strongman contest and it's this Saturday, we just signed you up for it. I had no idea what to expect. My experience with the sport was seeing these massive men on TV lifting cars and pulling trucks, and I just never thought that was attainable for me. On Saturdays, I'm at the gym anywhere between four and eight hours. It really is just a time-intensive sport to train for. Every time I step into the gym, I know that every single set, every single rep needs to be executed because that's gonna be the difference maker when I step onto the competition floor. You know, strong ed, it's really such a special sport because not only are you competing against the person next to you, but you're cheering for them as well. Nice, come on. Right back, gotta go. When you're competing against somebody, you want to beat them when they're at their best. Easy. And that's what makes the victory a lot more sweet. It's just this amazing community of supportive athletes. We know what it takes to compete in this sport. So there's just this general feeling of respect throughout all the competitors, which is so, so refreshing and exciting to see. I mean, training with Rob is, is pretty inspiring. Like, uh, I'm still an amateur in the sport, so it pushes me a lot, and my standard is a lot higher. Yes! Coming out for me was a little bit strange. I was in college, actually had a girlfriend at the time, and got to this point in my life where I realized that I was waking up every morning and just putting a facade on. I ended that relationship. I actually end up meeting Joey, who is now my husband. And I made the decision to go and talk to my immediate family. I was like, mom, I have to tell you something. She's like, oh God, somebody's pregnant. I was like, no, quite the opposite, actually, I'm gay. <laughs> and she was like, thank God. For me coming out, not only did it elevate my strongman career, it just elevated every aspect of my life because I was actually comfortable with who I was. We actually talked on the phone one night for like five hours straight and we didn't go to bed until like 4 a.m. just talking. Just his demeanor and like personality, it seemed like he was like a goal-driven person and just something I wasn't really used to because it's not typically the type of people that I went for, but it kind of just attracted me to him. I would train with him and actually seeing him like come out, like I saw like a shift in his mood and his emotions when he was training. Like it felt like a weight off of his shoulders. Or do you want to grab one of the strength pride ones? XL. Oh, perfect. Grab a silhouette as well. Same size. Yeah, yeah. All right. Awesome. Yeah, put them in there and just make stacks for the orders. Claiming the title World's Strongest Gay is, it's a power move. And it begins to change that narrative of what people think gay is. I get the most amazing messages of support and love, not only from people who feel that what I'm doing is the right thing, but from parents of LGBTQ kids who, they didn't know what their kid's life would look like, but seeing what my husband and I have, it gives them an idea and some hope for their children. Having that platform, it makes every single negative message that I've ever received a moot point. For me, I find strength and motivation from a few different places. It's the want and the need and the drive to compete and perform at my highest, but it's also that push from everybody that has been supporting me throughout the years. Progress is just any form of a better version of yourself. 
I really do want to end up being more of a, a pillar for the sport of strongman. LGBTQ plus representation is so limited already. To show an out and proud gay man who has an amazing husband who supports him, it really does begin to change that narrative and that conversation. It's not just about me being a gay strongman. It's about showing that regardless of your sexuality, anything is possible. Thank you.